Good morning, everyone. Ms. Hashem, mean high is going to be 525. Please be on time. The discussion we had yesterday was about the person who wanted to read the Megillah before the night, even though the time of the reading of Megillah is Tzitta Kochavim. He wants to read it from Plaga Mincha, an hour and 15 minutes before Tzitta Kochavim, and we said that if he's unable to read it, or the whole community is unable to read it after the night, let's say there is a closures or there's curfews, a lot of times they place cur- curfews in, on, this, uh, on the whole city, uh, things like that, they would be allowed to read it from Plaga Mincha an hour and 15 minutes before the night. What if Purim falls out on Sunday? Which means Motzei Shabbat is when you would read the Megillah, I believe that's how it is this year. What would be the Halakha? In that case, would you be able to read the Megillah? Let's say, for example, there was a doctor and this doctor needs Motzei Shabbat, he needs to right away go uh, do a surgery. And he's not going to have time to read the Megillah at night, he has to be in the, in the hospital, he's not going to have time. Can he read the Megillah on Shabbat, an hour and 15 minutes before the night of uh, Motzei Shabbat? Would he be permitted to do that? So there is an interesting Magen Avraham. Magen Avraham brings down that, well, on a technical level, there are certain things that you're allowed to do that belong to Motzei Shabbat on Shabbat. Like, for example, one is allowed to pray Alvit of Motzei Shabbat even an hour and 15 minutes before Shabbat is over, even though he's not allowed to do work in any sense well, until, until three stars come out. That's Chas Shalom. He's not allowed to do that. But to pray Alvit early in a case where he wouldn't be able to pray Alvit, uh, afterwards he would be permitted to pray from the time of Plaga Mincha. So the Magen Avam says, we see that there is such a concept of doing things that uh, are really uh, applicable to Motzei Shabbat on Shabbat itself during that time of Plaga Mincha. However, when it comes to the reading of the Megillah, we have a different issue, because the Gemara seems to say that we don't read the Megillah on Shabbat. And the reason is because we're afraid a person might come to carry the Megillah, and therefore they prohibited the reading of the Megillah on Shabbat. And, and therefore, Halakha Le Although it is debated to some extent, the Halakha Lema says you're not allowed to, you're not supposed to read the Megillah from Plaga Mincha on Shabbat for that night. Uh, you can't do that. Rather, what you should do is you should wait until it's Ben Hashemashot. Ben Hashemashot is after sunset. After sunset, before three stars come out, then you could read the Megillah. You'll read it quickly, you'll finish in 20 minutes or so. It'll already be considered, the, depends where he lives, 20, 30 minutes. they will already considered Motzei Shabbat. And then he'll be able to go straight to uh, to his job, to what he needs to do, the surgery that he needs to do. Amen.